I'm Kimberly Kay with your entertainment report from ManhattanNews.com. Ladies, this is my little fashion secret that's going to take off. If you are having a bad hair and or face day, I'm having both, just wear a hat. No one will know. And you know how at the end of every TV show it talks about the celebrities and what they're wearing and who it's by? Well, ladies, this is a brand new jacket from a friend of mine, and I left the tags on so you'd know it was new. <laughs> Another one of my little beauty secrets. That one might not be as good. Well, he gets colonic irrigations, Botox injections, and vitamin drips, and insists on black toilet paper in his home. A revealing new biography offers intimate, some might say too intimate, details about Simon Cowell, along with a portrait of the entertainment mogul's savvy business side. Sweet Revenge, The Intimate Life of Simon Cowell is written by British journalist and biographer Tom Bauer and centers on the tanned and brush-cut Cowell, who is 52, who has gained fame in both Britain and North America as a producer and an acerbic judge on TV talent shows, including The X Factor. And the book paints a picture of a man who struggled for years in the music business, spurred on to success out of a desire to prove his detractors wrong and in the process earned a fortune estimated at $320 million. I'm guessing he proved his detractors wrong. Well, British fashion designer Victoria Beckham, you know, I should be wearing one of her designs right now, had her soccer superstar husband David in mind when helping create a new special edition of Range Rover's off-road vehicle, the Evoque. The special edition Evoque features exclusive hand-finished matte paint, the first for a Land Rover type vehicle. The vehicle also has rose gold accents on the grille and gloss black forged alloy wheels. I don't even know what any of that means. Inside, the four-seat coupe includes vintage-inspired leather seats, rose gold plated accents, and features trimmings of black lacquer, textured aluminum, and mohair. And in addition, the vehicle comes with luxury accessories such as four-piece leather luggage set and a hand-sewn leather wallet for the owner's manual signed by Victoria Beckham herself. Well, the special edition Evoque cost 80,000 pounds, $129,000, and will be the first of which will be rolled out in China as early as October. Now my car is also for sale. It's a vintage 2002 PT Cruiser with 150,000 miles on it. It's uh, gold and rather scratched and instead of luggage you get lots of crumbs and hair and well, a whole lot of other crap in it. So did you know that the world record for the biggest plate of nachos is nearly 4,000 pounds? That's right, actual pounds. At least that was the record. It was topped over the weekend in Lawrence, Kansas, where an 80-foot plate of nachos weighing 4,689 pounds was served at the Kansas Relays. It was gobbled up by noon, and breaking the record was no easy task. For one thing, a cooler went out, and a ton of food was literally spoiled. Organizers worked with local suppliers to replace all the bad food and make new nachos. In local entertainment news, Danny Dillon and the Improv Nation return to Shadowland Theater. SNL alumni and Tony Award-nominated stage film and TV actress brings her passion for improv to downtown Ellenville. The date is May 5th at 8 p.m. For info and reservations, call 647-5511. That's your latest entertainment report. For a new update daily, log on to MidHudsonNews.com. I'm Kimberly Kay.